Hello YouTube, how's everybody? Steely Blast, SoundCloud, The Black Madonna. How's everybody? How's your family? How's your seeds? Feeling good about life? <clears throat> Feel good about life. Do. <laughs> Inner happiness is the key. Yes, it is. So, so uh, I hope everyone's having a nice weekend so far. I am. I uh, had a very great day today. I had a great day yesterday, you know. <laughs> so um, I decided to come in um, and do the news. I said that I'd be back between uh, uh, 9 and 10 tomorrow. So here it is. It's uh, tomorrow. Okay, now um, the news that I have here, um, some of it is uh, kind of short. Uh, they've been uh, having some of the, some of the uh, 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 stories, uh, they're kind of short and straight to the point. Whereas you have <clears throat> you have others that kind of give you details, you know what 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 went on from so uh, you know so this is what I'm uh, doing my report on today. All right, so most of these stories are, are short, okay, uh, but they're worth uh, they're worth uh, you know reporting, okay, at the same time. All right, okay, here we go. Okay, now a uh, 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 Springfield man uh, wanted uh, for murder uh, in New Mexico. Uh, state police at Springfield, Mass. WWLP. Okay, now a man uh, from Springfield uh, who was wanted on connection with the homicide was arrested uh, by state police uh, in New Mexico Thursday. Twenty-seven-year-old uh, Gilfrey <coughs> uh, Gregory uh, was arrested after a police received a tip. Okay, he was driving a car uh, with Florida license plate, uh, and there were about five individuals, uh, uh, passengers uh, in the car with him. Okay, okay. Now a nurse is arrested <clears throat> on suspicion of uh, killing a ba killing of eight babies and trying to kill nine more uh, in the UK a hospital. Okay, uh, Lucy uh, Lelby, uh, twenty nine, allegedly uh, tried to kill another nine infants uh, left in her care between two thousand fifteen and two thousand sixteen. Okay, now a couple charged uh, a, a man, a uh, girlfriend, a uh, three-year-old. I'm sorry, a couple charged uh, after uh, a man uh, hits the girlfriend's three-year-old so hard uh, in his abdomen that his abdomen r uh, ruptured. Okay, so it was, it was leading. Uh, it led to a very, very painful death. Okay, uh, 36 hours later, he lasted 36 hours after that blow to the abdomen. Uh, he killed that little boy. I say it over and over again. Ladies, keep men away from your children. They don't meet your children unless there is something going on. You de you decided that you want to uh, hook up. You decide you want to claim one another. You want to make a relationship. That's when they meet your children. Otherwise, keep men the fuck out your house and away from your children. And how dare he hit that little boy? He uh, He obviously has been hitting that little boy. And this time he hit him just a little too hard. And you dumb bitch. So uh, hopefully her ass go to jail just as hard as he. And I believe she is too. What's her name? Her name is Kaylee uh, Siswick. And her boyfriend Kyle Campbell were found guilty in the death of her former sons. Uh, his name was Riley. And he was sentenced, you know. They were sentenced in a uh, crown court. Okay, so... Uh, uh, you know, th this is terrible. You know, I, I think, you know, ladies, you think that when men buy your kid a blow pop, he might buy your kid a bag of potato chips and, ah, uh, he likes my child. You don't know that. Uh, what he trying to do is get close to your child to please you, bitch, huh? just to get with you. And then when he ain't with you no more, he ain't starting your child. Come on, let us experience, experience, experience. Ladies, keep men away from your children. Keep men out your house. They have nothing to do with your children. They don't talk to them. They don't meet them. They don't do anything with the son of a bitch. Eventually, he will meet the children. Uh, you know, you got to acknowledge mine. Ha. You got to treat mine properly. Ha. You you do. You do. And you, my kids ain't going to let no man come up in here and jiggle me around and burn a hole in my couch or burn a hole in my goddamn bed. My kids ain't going for that. You know why? Because I'm not going for that. Ha. Negro police trying to have two women. Ha. And when ha. My father told me never become a man's bad pig. My father told me we always expect the unexpected and he said have fun with men you know but not too much fun he said have a few ha, but not that many and you desperate ass bitches letting these men destroy your children because you so in love this other lady this man was raping her daughters so she bought them birth control to keep them from getting pregnant and stop getting abortions because she didn't want him to leave her that's why she never stood up for him for her daughters he just let him just rape her daughters 
Wake up. Okay. Sheriff, uh, an eight-year-old boy calls 911 after walking in on his stepdad, strangling his mother. Dogs uh, chew through a door, and they attack an elderly woman they killed her in Brooksville. Uh, despite a plea of an of ex-wife to spare his life, South Carolina man, man, I'm sorry, who was killed, he killed their five kids, uh, is sentenced to death. And again, the mother stands up before the court and asks the judge to spare his life. Did he spare those five children's lives? See, dumb bitches all over the place. Men is the key for blacks to have a family. Grab a woman and build. But you know what? It's some dumbass black nigga bitches too that make the world fucked up and they make it bad for the women that's good, that's decent, have a chance. You got these dumb bitches letting pedophiles hang around, like not charging the pedophiles for crimes. You understand? Black women is sad when it comes to a man sometimes. Ha! And you just gotta have a man. Any old man, just as long as it's a man. And you, you, you neglect your children for him. Huh, how dare you? A Pennsylvania woman died last year at the same D Dominican resort of three others. Uh, the FBI is very concerned. Uh, the FBI is investigating. Uh, now, Yvette Nicole, uh, uh, she's a uh, sports death, uh, was uh, in, in initially classified uh, as a heart attack, uh, but now uh, it's being investigated. Something is going on over there in the Dominican Republic. I got a phone call yesterday, y'all, uh, from some people trying to get some money out of me and, and want me to desperately go to the Dominican Republic. I blocked them. See you later. But I wrote, I wrote shit down, you know, just in case. Uh, but watch your phone calls. People are calling with scams every day. All right, here we go. Uh, now, Arizona teacher who tested a sixth grade, <laughs> who text a sixth grade boy. <laughs> I want you every day. Please guilty to molesting him. Uh, Brittany Zamor uh, admits a sexual sexual conduct sexual conduct with the minor, a molestation of a child, and public uh, sexual indecency. Yeah, I don't understand the teachers or the lady teachers want to sleep with a sixth <laughs> a sixth grade little boy. All right, you're supposed to be there to teach them, you know, not offer pussy. You you're stepping out of line. You're violating him for your own sick pleasures. You know. <laughs> Okay. All right. A Florida woman accused of fatally stabbing her husband, who was once her stepfather. Daniel Redelick is accused in January. She was accused in January. Uh, Daniel Redelick is charged. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. D Daniel Redelick. Uh, um, okay. Yeah. She's being charged with second degree uh, murder and tampering with physical evidence. Uh, Michael Red Red Redelick uh, uh, has died uh, of his injuries. Okay. So now this was her stepfather. Okay, uh, so eventually something went bad because she stabbed his ass and she's being charged now with second degree murder and tampering with uh, physical evidence. So his name is Michael Redelick. Uh, he has died of his injuries. Okay, all right. Now, uh, I believe that is it. Okay, that's going to be the news for tonight already. Uh, thank you for listening. <laughs> all right, uh, don't leave. I'll be back. All right, don't leave. I'll be back. Don't go nowhere because I'll be right back. <laughs> All right, we're going to upload another video. We're going to try to too. Uh, if it gets a little messy, then we'll stop and figure things out. All right, strategy, strategy. All right, ladies, stay out of trouble. Uh, men, uh, continue to be a good father. Watch out for your children, whether you're with the woman or not. You take care of the child. Don't forget the child because they need you too. Understand? They need you. And just because a boy is 23 years old or 21 years old doesn't mean that he can't, you know, use a hand. He can use a hand to touch his shoulders and teach him things and tell him what to do as a man. So when he gets ready for real life men on his own, he'll have that knowledge in his head from his dad. But most dads, when they break up, uh, say like if you meet somebody and it, and it really goes well and you get married and this guy's not molesting your children and like you have one that you are biological with someone else, they'll be that that kid's daddy. But guess what? When y'all break up, he going to fuck the kid. Fuck her. Fuck it. They don't call the kid. They don't see the kid. You know, they're looking for excuses not to even have anything to do with the kid. Experience, experience, experience. Never let a child call another man daddy. Because when the shit is over with, it ain't daddy at all. And it never really was. It was just to please you. Yeah. Yeah, I better watch out for that. Men giving y'all mercy dick. But it's your children that they really want to fuck. Watch out for that. Ha. Somebody being too fucking nice to your child. What the fuck is up? You want to fuck my child? You know? 
All right. Okay, that's it. All right. Don't go anywhere because I'll be right back. All right. Hey, Didi Blast, SoundCloud, uh, the Black Madonna will be back with another set for news tonight. Okay. All right. We'll see you then. Okay. Bye now. <laughs>